Domestic violence. What does this mean? Who can it happen to? But most importantly, who does it affect? Hi, my name is Genesee Andrew, and my mother was a victim of domestic violence. What is domestic violence, you ask? It is behaviors used by one person in a relationship to control or hurt another. It can include name calling, pushing, hitting, threatening, sexual assault, intimidation, and stalking. Domestic violence can also include blaming, isolation, withholding money, and also using children against each other. Who can it happen to, you ask? Domestic violence victims can be of any race, sex, age, religion, or culture. Who does this affect? It can affect your whole family, your friends, your coworkers, and even affect your whole community. My siblings and I were born and raised here in the remote city of Bethel, along the western coast of Alaska. We had pretty much an average childhood. We had our birthday parties, holiday gatherings, family vacations, and school functions. As we got older and I moved away to college, my parents' relationship started to change. They had the occasional arguments and misunderstandings, but we never thought it would come to this. On May 29, 2005, four days after my college graduation, my mother was killed by my father over a domestic dispute gone bad. In the years prior to this incident, I saw all the red flags but chose to ignore them and thought to myself, it's okay, they'll get over it, or it's okay, it's just one of those days. I made that mistake and it took the most important person in my life away from me. We miss her at weddings, at births, and at special occasions. We think of her during holidays, graduations, and birthdays. But most of all, her grandchildren never had the opportunity to meet her as a grandmother, something she so dearly wanted to be. Please, if you or someone you know is a victim of domestic violence, please seek help. Don't wait until it's too late. I did.